Today we're going to be looking at the science of how apples may be able to prevent cancer. Apples are a good source of dietary fiber, flavonoids, and polyphenol compounds that partner with gut microbes to create an environment that may help reduce the risk of cancer. Observational studies link apples with a lower risk of different types of cancer. Cancer is a disease in which some of the body's cells grow uncontrollably and spread to other parts of the body. It's a complex process and certain compounds in our foods can inhibit this uncontrollable growth or even kill the cancer cells. Apples contain some potent antioxidant and anti-cancer properties. Consumption of the whole apple provides a very significant prebiotic by acting as a fertilizer that stimulates the growth of beneficial gut bacteria. These friendly gut bacteria produce anti-inflammatory compounds that help protect from cancer and other chronic diseases. Note that much of these properties are found in the peel of the apple, so make sure to eat the whole apple. In a recent review study published in 2021, researchers found that apple phytochemicals inhibit inflammation and inhibit the proliferation of cancer cells. At the same time, they can also promote the destruction of cancer cells. A 2007 study showed that apple phytochemicals inhibit growth factors involved in cancer development invasion and the metastasis of cancer cells. A 2014 review article looked into the effects of quercetin in apples. The study concluded that quercetin can inhibit cell proliferation of breast, ovarian, lung, and liver cancer cells in the test tube or in culture dishes. In a 2004 study published in Nutrition Journal, in vitro and animal studies demonstrated that apples have high antioxidant activity. They can also inhibit cancer cell proliferation and lower cholesterol, potentially explaining their role in reducing risk of chronic disease overall. Also, recent research has shown that apples do contain bioavailable phytochemicals. The study also tested apple extract against human liver cancer cells. At 50 milligrams, the extract derived from the apple skin inhibited those cancer cells by 57%. The apple extract derived from the fruit's fleshy part inhibited cancer by 40%. In a 2005 Italian comparative study, researchers found that people who regularly consumed one apple a day reduced their risk for oral and throat cancers by 21%, lowered their risk for esophageal cancer by 25%, and decreased their risk of colorectal cancer by 42%, the risk for breast cancer was reduced by 15%. A 2017 study published in the Journal of Food and Drug Analysis, researchers studied specific apple polyphenols and found that they had promising chemopreventive and chemotherapeutic effects against cancer. In addition to its antioxidant activity, researchers demonstrated that apple polyphenols have significant effects in the signaling pathways that control cell survival, growth, and proliferation. 
they found that fluoritin inhibited proliferation and induced apoptosis in cancer cells. In a 2021 analysis, fluoretin was shown to inhibit the proliferation of cancer cells, cause cell death, and also prevent the invasion and migration of cancer cells. The studies show that apples contain potent compounds that can help us fight against cancer. While there are some questions about the bioavailability of these nutrients in apples, and more human studies would be good, we certainly don't have to wait to incorporate more apples into our diet. They are nutritious and delicious and have many other additional health benefits. I hope you enjoyed the information in this video. If you did, please give us a like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.